dozens of NFL players kneel on the field during the national anthem today. This is all in response to strong words from President Donald Trump condemning the action. Other players linked arms. Some didn't even take the field. Only one Steelers player, who's a veteran, showed for the national anthem. A couple of Kansas City Chiefs players kneeled too, even sat during today's anthem. 41 Action News reporter Stephen Dial is joining us live. And Stephen, you spoke with some fans, even some former Chiefs about this. What did they have to say? Well, Dia, first and foremost, the president of the United States just arrived at the White House. He says that his anger is not about race. It's about respect for our country. You're right. I talked to many Chiefs fans today and some former players, and they all say that people should have their own opinion. Wouldn't you love to see one of these NFL owners when somebody disrespects our flag to say, get that son of a off the field right now. This comment from President Trump created a firestorm reaction on social media. He criticized NFL athletes for taking a knee during the national anthem. There are a lot of people that feel you should stand and they're, they're not shying away from it. So I think it's been a very combustible morning uh, for the NFL. Here at Arrowhead Stadium is tradition to yell Chiefs at the end of the national anthem. Sunday, players, coaches, and owners from around the NFL stood against the president's comments. They've got to run the football effectively. Mark Borichter is a former Chiefs wide receiver. As I stand for the national anthem, I think most people should stand for the national anthem, but I think we also live in a country where I fully respect an individual's right to, to do what they want to do. Chief CEO Clark Hunt sent a statement saying that he believes in, quote, honoring the American flag and supporting all those whose sacrifices protect the many freedoms we have in this country including the right to have difference of opinions. We asked Chiefs fans about what they think about players not standing for the national anthem. I get people saying that they want people to support or like to stand for the flag and, and, the, and all that, but uh, I also understand the fact that you need to do something when you see all these other horrible things happening all over. What are your thoughts about NFL players taking a knee? There's my thoughts. Uh, I mean, obviously, Marcus Peters is a tremendous player, you know, one of the best young rookies we got. Um, but yeah, as soon as he made that statement, uh, I went out and bought a shirt. They absolutely should be, you know what I mean? That it's, you know, you gotta stand up for what you believe in. Bo Richter says people need to remember NFL athletes are individuals as well. I don't like the whole stick, stick to sports mentality um, from that side of things. I think it takes away your rights just as, a, as an American and a human. It will be interesting to see when the Chiefs have a home game hosting the Redskins on Monday night, next Monday, October 2nd. It will be interesting to see if any players continue with this protest. Reporting live at the Ale House in Westport, Stephen Dial, 41 Action News. Thanks, Stephen. Tonight, the NFL debuts its Unity ad called Inside the Lines. It's meant to be an inspirational message to demonstrate what the NFL is all about. You can find a link to it on our website, KSHB.com.